Karina Mitchell. Damn, she oh. fucking fun. She's fun. Every person in this game show? is hot. Yes. Stress with everyone. Okay. Okay. Oh God. Oh shit. <laughs> that scared me. What's good, guys? Good guy Gasly here with more Detective Pikachu, the best game on the planet, game of the year, number one. Working on a video about that actually, uh, like right now. Uh, but we're on our search for Pure Ugly. Uh, we're looking for a big fat cat, but if we're being honest, if you want to see pure ugly, all you got to do is, uh, look in the mirror. Like, I mean me, not you, but me. All I have to do is look in the, every day I look in the mirror and I'm just like, wow, you are the embodiment of a pure, pure ugly. Uh, anyway, so we, uh, have already looked in this room. This woman, this, this woman is the owner of that pure ugly. Uh, someone else mentioned in a comment in another video, why are they keeping a Magnemite or a Magneton? I forgot, or Mag... One of those Pokemon that's a magnet <laughs> in a box. Why don't they have Pokeballs? You know what I just realized, guys? I have not seen one Pokeball in this entire series. In this entire game, I have not seen a Pokeball. It makes you wonder, right? Now, you'd think there'd be like a Pokeball like store that you could go to. Uh, and, and, you know, if the Pokemon are real, like, I bet people would just like put stickers all over their Pokemon, Pokeballs and all that stuff. Oh, it's our boy, uh, Max. Is his name Max? His name is Max. Us? Huh? Have you found Perugly? Not yet. Sorry. I swear, where could it have gone? This is nothing new, but I wish it'd stop. It's got big purple ears, probably as big as my face, I'd say. Wow, that's, that's big because you have a big face. Maybe it's a big Pokemon. All right, so we're looking for a Pokemon with purple ears. I bet it's hiding behind something. Like, I bet we could search, like, how is a Peruglie gonna, Peruglies are pretty big, guys, I'm not gonna lie, like, I'm not even being mean, like, or fictitious, like, they are big, okay, it's in here, we're getting, we're getting a saving, so it's in here, okay, Pikachu looking adorable, looking adorbs, hmm, hmm. where's that music coming from, oh. hmm. in here, it's kind of creepy, what are you oh. doing, Pikachu? It's a cricket tune. Karina Mitchell. Damn, she's oh. fucking fun. She's fun. I've never heard such a beautiful sound. I've never seen such a beautiful woman play such a beautiful sound. Pikachu, come on. Cricket tune is weird. What's wrong, cricket tune? Oh, cricket. Oh, so sorry. Didn't mean to intrude. He, he no, sounds so right. funny. I was just a little surprised. That's all. I'm sorry. Every person in this game show? is hot. Yes. My name's Karina. Karina. Nice to meet you. You're a attractive middle-aged musician. <laughs> and this is my partner, Cricketune. <laughs> sorry, it seems to be in a bad mood. Pika, 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 Pika. <laughs> Aren't you a cute Pikachu, huh? Uh, uh don't let him fool oh you. Oh my gosh. Don't let him fool you. I'm the cute one. Don't. I'm the. I'm the adorable one. Well, Karina, what's your name? Yes. Oh, are you a staff member of Maxim Music? Is the rehearsal about to start? No, we're actually looking for Perugly. Mr. Graham asked for our help. Oh, I see. Perugly was around here until just a little while ago, but oh, so you did see it. Hey, about what you're doing tonight after the show? Can I ask you that? So you said Perugly was here earlier. Yes, it wandered around and glared at me and cricket tune and then just left. Okay. Are you interested in the violin? It was a gift from my grandfather back when I was a little. I guess it's safe to assume you're a violinist then. Duh! God, this guy... No, no wonder Tim never gets the girls. He just says things like that. Yes, although I'm very new to the scene. You really played a beautiful tune. I'm looking forward to the show. Oh, thank you, but... I'm not very good at being in the spotlight. I think I'll be fine as long as I'm performing. But I can't imagine what it's going to be like speaking in front of cameras. I'm so nervous. But you have Cricket Tune with you. You have your middle-aged partner with you. I'm sure he's experienced. Cricketoon. It says, quite right, young man. Oh my god, he is a fine, established gentleman. There are no... There are no scuffs on this man's cuffs. Okay. <laughs> I was having Cricketoon help me with tuning my violin. I wonder if Cricketoon... Yeah, it can, it can do that? That's cool. It's very sensitive to sounds, and it can compose melodies on the spot using its arms. Hmm. Cricketoon, that's pretty impressive. We'll be performing a duet on the show. You could come watch if you'd like. Imagine if your favorite video game music was conducted by a Pokemon. A Cricketune, to be exact. 
sensitive to sound. If he's sensitive to sound, maybe we can ask him to find Pure Ugly's ugly face. Oh, I can't even- I can't even replicate that. That was just amazing. Hey, no need to be so defensive. I'm just a fan of Karina's. Let's be friends, brother. There you go again with your chit-chat. Oh, you've met Pure Ugly before. That makes things easier. Did it come around here? It came by to kill time, and it shoved you out of the way and took your spot on the sofa for a nap. <laughs> That's pretty selfish. Seems Perugly will take any spot that catches its fancy, never mind if someone's already there or not. Guys, I feel like... I feel like we don't have Mimikyu. Like, I want to find that Mimikyu that was around here. Karina is just plain gorgeous. You've got to introduce me. Cricketoon. What? You can't let some random Pokemon get close to Karina? She's like a daughter to you? You're being overprotective, Cricketoon. I wonder if Pokemon are like dogs. You know how like you get undressed around your dog? I mean, come on, we've all done it. We all we all don't care if our animal is in the room. We will we will get undressed. We will do the nastiest things with our dogs in the room. I wonder if people do that with Pokemon. Like, oh my Cricketune is just like in the room watching me like go on you porn or something. I don't know. Alright, uh <laughs> let's see. Uh never repeat these things to anyone. Okay, can we ask them about, uh, can we ask about anything yes. else? No. I hope it's okay. Oh man, her little yes is like super seductive. Yes. Uh, yes. Stop that. Karina, stop that. My loins. My, my precious loins. My micromodal meundies. Okay, let's go uh, check the security cameras. Can we do that? We don't. Can we just keep checking? Why does everywhere just have security cameras? We could just do security cameras all day and win the game. Hey, let me ask you about Perugly. Hmm? That's right. I'm sorry, Olga's causing so much trouble. If you need anything, just ask. Between you and me, Perugly is a pretty vain Pokemon. It cinches its waist with its tail to make it look bigger and beefier. <laughs> That's a strange habit. Well, it's a TV star. Even if it is a Pokemon, it just wants to look its best. Hmm, okay, it makes itself look bigger. Interesting. Okay. That's weird, all the static on the screens. Hmm, let me ask you about Perugly. Screw your static. Perugly, now that you mention it, I don't think I've seen it today. It's usually wandering around the dressing rooms. I've been seeing this weird static on the video feed from the studio. It might be. Seems like the equipment here is fine, but either way, we need to fix it before the rehearsal. Okay, so I have like tons of stuff to do. You guys are giving me lots of jobs. Who, who, don't you know anything? Hmm. I've never occurred to you. Well, yeah, that figures, I guess. Let me ask you about Hero. It says Hero's dream is to make programs that everyone can watch and enjoy as a family. It says it's going to do its best to help. That's really nice. Oh, okay, so that's part of the case, apparently. It says Pure Ugly is why things don't run on time around here. Oh, he must hate Pure Ugly. We'll find it for you. Okay. What's up? Oh, about the interference. Does he know anything about the interference? I'm checking the footage from the studio cameras, but it seems like it's not working right. I'm getting a lot of static. Yeah, I know. We just heard about that. Okay. Uh, so let's go check out what might be doing that. I bet. Oh, I bet it. That that's Mimikyu. That's Mimikyu for sure. That's got to be Mimikyu is doing causing that stress with everyone. Okay. Okay. Oh God. Oh shit, <laughs> it scared me. <laughs> Dreams of being popular. Woo, just like walk down a hallway and I didn't expect that. Hey, could you get out of the way? That, what's that? I'm trying to steal your chance to shine. Do you know this Pokemon Pikachu? N no, this is Mimikyu. It's a star Pokemon scheduled to make an appearance on the show after maximum music apparently. <gasps> dude, Pika, dude, Mike. What's gonna happen is gonna happen. They're gonna show Mimikyu's body on camera and everyone's gonna die. Since we do look alike, I think it's worried that I'll steal the spotlight from it. It doesn't need to worry about that. We are not even trying to be a part of the... Whoa. Relax, dude. Tim? Huh, what are you doing here? Mimikyu? I thought you were told to stay in the dressing room until it was your turn to be on the show. Hey, stop struggling. Tim, do you think you could tell your Pikachu to use its move and get Mimikyu to calm down? Huh, well, uh, you see, Pikachu can't use any moves. <laughs> really? I didn't know Pokemon like that existed. I didn't know, uh, crippled Pokemon existed. Yeah, that was a very nice way of putting it. Yeah, never heard of that before. Who needs moves when I have my amazing intellect? Well, if that's the case, I guess it can't be helped. Come on, Mimikyu, back to the dressing room. If you don't behave, I'll have to ban you from GNN. Ooh. I'll see you later, Tim. 
Man, he wanted to go right to the violence, but he could have. That was easy. He could have just been like, hey, okay. Jim. Mimikyu, huh? It was like a little typhoon. Yeah, and it was a star Pokemon, right? We didn't get a chance to ask it, but it might know something about Perugly. Good point. We should go ask it later. As in, let's ask it now. Dude, Mimikyu is terrifying. Mimikyu, you're in here, right? No, Mimikyu's not in here. I guess Mimikyu's in the other room that's right above this one. Oh my goodness. Let's go see what Mimikyu looks like underneath his, his cloak. His, his, little, his little bag. Okay, Mimikyu, I'm gonna ask you a few questions, okay? You do a pretty good job mimicking me, I'll give you that. But, if you don't mind, I'd like to see what you look like under that cloth. Nope. Ah! Oh, Pikachu died. Okay, let's see. Um, you got locked up again, thanks to us. That's because you decided to cause trouble in front of everyone. At this rate, you'll lose to Magnemite. Magnemite? You passed it in the hallway just now. Is it going to be on the next show, too? It's probably trying to get the attention of important people, too. Man, you're a competitive one. Is this how all the star Pokemon are? Passed by Magnemite. I thought Magnemite was in here. Okay, so that's what's causing the static. We know that. Magnemite is here. Okay, wait, hang on. I gotta talk to Pikachu again. Let's go in there and talk to Pikachu again. I just want to see him. Maybe something. Maybe he tells us a clue. You know? Nothing to worry about, Tim. Okay. I'll still continue my work as a detective, even if I do become a star. Pikachu, I had to break it to you, but, uh, you're not going to become a star because you're just too good of a detective. Everyone would think of all the crimes that wouldn't get solved if you weren't here. Guys, I was, t I went to a convention yesterday and saw my favorite, uh, VFX artist, Quarter Digital, do a live Q&A. Uh, I asked them a question. It was so fun. I actually got to ask them a question. There's video of me talking to my idols and it was great. I didn't tell him I have a YouTube channel. I didn't want to tell him I do Pokemon videos. Huh, I don't think it likes me very much. Let me ask you about Mimikyu. That Pokemon was here first thing in the morning, just wandering around the studio. Another staff member took it to the dressing room so it wouldn't get in the way of filming, but... Maybe they forgot to lock the door? It was a pretty busy morning, so it wouldn't surprise me if it had slipped their mind. I made a mistake while brushing it this one time. Ever since then, it gets all agitated and wags its tail around when I get close. Hmm. Okay, let me ask you guys. Do you know anything about the cameras and why they're like that? Nope, you guys don't. What about you? Yum yum. Yum yum. Oh, thanks. Let us know if you see it. Oh, wait, I can ask it. Okay. Apparently, Purugly is really picky about footage. It always has some complaint or another, and it tries to swat the cameras down with his tail. Dude, this Purugly, like, let's just forget about this Purugly. Can't there be a new star of the show? This Purugly is a terrible person. We should go check that way too then. It'll give us a chance to talk to the people in the dressing rooms as well. So we already did that. That's not an issue. I'm I'm really just feel like Prugly is hiding behind something with purple ears. Any news? No, no news, Ariel. God, except that your kingdom's under attack and your dad has been captured by Ursula. Okay. Purple ears. We got this. We got this. Uh you know, and some I guess sometimes I, I do cut footage. When uh, I maybe take too long to look for something, so I apologize. I don't know if you guys mind that, that I look through. Maybe I'm just like looking too hard or something. Oh, wait, I never asked yeah. Chat Top. Hmm. It might be in the dressing room next door. It's apparently Pirugly's daily routine to go to every dressing room and make sure Pokemon don't get too full of themselves. They say Pokemon take after their partner, so I bet it's got a temper. Dude, yeah, let's just, like, this Pirugly is not that impressive. Like, can we not? <sighs> this is like giving the most hated person a platform to just spit their drivel. We've been able to find out a lot about Pirugly. Let's take some time to think about it. So are we ready to put the case together, Pikachu? This is really difficult. I don't know if we have enough evidence. Let's try and figure out where Pirugly might be, based on its characteristics, of course. Okay, okay, maybe we can, maybe we can. Can any of the characters be a clue? All right, so uh, we have it always start stares down chat top. Uh, when it finds a spot it likes, it plops right down even if someone's already there. I love the little pictures in the top right. Oh, it looks like a flower. 
I'm really confused with what's happening right now. This is not right. God damn it! Which Pokemon do you think it could be? I don't know, Pikachu. You drive me nuts. What if we use Cricketune? Yeah, we're gonna get this. We're gonna get this. I'm, I'm, I got this. So, what if it's back here? It's just back here. It's behind these flowers. It's a fucking giant cat. Where could it be? This is rough, guys. This is really, really rough. I don't know what else to do. I think I've, I've lost this game. We've played on hard mode, and it's just worked against us, and now we've, we've lost. Dude, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. This is so hard. Not so sure we, we're gonna be here we're off freaking night, Pikachu. You're killing me, dude. This is the hardest game I've ever played in my life. Like, in context, none of these make any sense. Uh, I'm at the point where I just run around and click on things and hope that it's the, what I need. But I don't think it is. Oh my god, I have things to do today. I have people to see and I'm stuck looking for a freaking perugly. Oh my god, I just figured it out. I just figured it out. Perugly is in the box. Perugly, Perugly is inside the box. That Magnemite's supposed to be in. Let's try and figure out where Perugly might be. Oh Based my god, I just figured it out. This is... Course. Okay. Come on, do you oh my you god, think? I figured it out. Okay, Chatot is Magnemite. It's great at vocal mimic. Chatot mimicked Olga's voice. Fuck! Dude, this I'm is so hard. Sure tell us where Perugly went. I suck at this game! Oh, what about this one? It stole, it uh, stole Magnemite's spot. You think it's related? If that's the case, it could involve another Pokemon. Okay, so it wasn't nefarious. Which Pokemon do you think it could be? It stole uh, someone's spot. Oh, we got this. Magnemite. Now, why do you think? Okay, that? this is okay. So I was looking at it like as a nefarious thing, but it's just pure ugly being a jerk and being like, "Hey, I'm a cat." What do cats love, guys? Cats love boxes. Cats, if I if I fits, I sits. So, Magnemite is in its cage. But then mimic you past Magnemite in the hall. Oh my God! Magnemite had its nest taken by Perugly. Yes. And moved to a new area. Yes. So it seems Perugly chased away Magnemite and took over its home. Yes. Which means Perugly is where? He's in the box! <laughs> He's right in here. So, oh. now you know where Magnemite's cage is, of course. This game sent me room. on a freaking ride, my guys. That was ridiculous. Holy crap. I don't want to say. That was like a lot of fails. You found it. This is her darling. Ew, body. is it dead? I What's happening? So. Wow, talk about slack. Yeah. Well, we found Perugly, but why is it taking over this spot? Yeah, that means the Magnemite is interrupting the feed. What's that? You want to fight? Whoa. Pikachu, there's no time for a staring contest. I'm going to find Keith. Hey, this isn't a staring contest. <laughs> oh my goodness. Okay. Let's end the episode right there. We're going to go into the next one right away. Oh my God. That was crazy. That was absolutely nuts. Thank you guys for watching. I'm Guy Gasly. Like this video if you thought it was enjoyable. And if you do things in front of your dog that you shouldn't. And your animals. Because they're animals. They don't care. Anyways, have a good day. I'm Guy Gasly. That is GG.